All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Hope you're all having a great day. Got a quick one for you today. Quick reminder, though, to please drop a like on this video if you enjoy it. Also, drop a comment down below on how you feel about this topic. I'm responding to every single one of you. And last thing, if you are new, please subscribe. So, yeah, let's get into it. According to Buster Only of ESPN, the Yankees have had internal discussions about Matt Chapman of the Oakland A's, but not to play third base but to play shortstop. And Chapman only has, I'm pretty sure, like around 10 career innings, MLB innings at the position. He has played there in the minors a little bit, and I think in college as well. Um, but yeah, he's a third baseman. The thing is, he's so athletic. He's like, I think, 25, 26 years old. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I got his age right here. Let me double check on that. How old are you? Actually, he's 28, but still. Prime of his career. Um, athletic. Already on the left side of the infield. Third base is probably a harder position, at least in terms of fielding. Uh, so I have no doubt he'd be able to... Uh, to play but Buster only he was on the K show um, I'm just gonna play the whole clip I think they'll wind up with one of the Oakland guys like I think that uh, you know Matt Chapman for example maybe you acquire him to be the one-year shortstop I know he's a third baseman he's exceptional but if you added Matt Chapman you would be improving your defense on the left side of the infield and I know they the Yankees have talked a little bit about this internally uh, look can Matt Chapman play shortstop um, you know, I think they, they wind up with one of those guys. Maybe it's Olsen, and then they hold back and they pay Aaron Judge. I think he also, like Stanton, proved a lot to them last mm -hmm. year. Because the question for idiots like me the last few years was, can this guy stay on the field? Last year he did. Now, obviously, this is just radio talk as of right now, but it is pretty telling that only said the Yankees have had conversations about this, which means unless only lying, which I don't think he is, that means this is like real. This is like an actual story, which is nice to have considering, you know, the kind of boring last month or so we've had as baseball fans with like this lockout and stuff. Um, to have a legitimate piece of news to bite on even if it ends up being BS. Um, but yeah, brief overview on Chapman's 2021 because this video doesn't really need to be all that long. I'll probably make a more detailed video about this if something develops like a month from now. Um, but yeah, if you haven't heard, Chapman's offensive statistics have regressed. Hit 27 homers last year, but his mediocre slash line and 101 WRC+. Plus, that has him far removed from the success we saw a couple years ago in 2017 and 2018, or 2018 and 2019, excuse me, uh, where he put up back-to-back -back seasons with an OPS over 850. Uh, but if you want to dig deeper into some peripherals, they do help him out a little bit. He did rank eight in the 86th percentile in barrel percentage last year, um, so that's somewhat promising. But regardless, he was still a three and a half war player, which unless we sign Correa or Trevor Story, I would 100%. If you told me a fact right now, we're getting a three and a half war out of the Yankees shortstop position next year. Besides, unless we get Correa or Story, I'm taking that 100%. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think about this. I know it was a quick video. I just wanted to update you because it's kind of a big story, especially for the fact, once again, the only said that the Yankees have already had conversations about that, about, about this, this offseason, which is dope. Um, and obviously, this is the extent that we'll hear about it for now until the lockout's over in hopefully like a month or so. Um, but yeah, drop a comment down below. How do you feel about this? And really just tell me flat out right now in the comments, who will be the Yankees shortstop come opening day in 2022? I feel like I keep confusing, not confusing, but I still am struggling to say 2022. Like I almost just said 2021. And I may have done it early in this video. And if I did, I apologize. That's a do it for this video, guys. Hope you all enjoyed. Let's go Yankees. See you next time.